It's Kelsey. And he don't want nothing wrong with that, but I'm happy with what I have. <laughs> oh, good. Oh, okay. That, uh, <laughs> See, I'm not now, even mad about that one. I'm yeah, we, we got to give it all <laughs> <laughs>your girl emily curl and today we're joined by kelsey ballerini as we get ready to play another episode of our fan versus artist trivia kelsey welcome are you ready to play some I'm, trivia with your biggest fan i'm very competitive and i feel a little guilty and weird about being competitive with a fan but i am <laughs> still ready <laughs> it's gonna be fun we have your biggest fan powell here he is so cute and he's so excited but again he's your biggest fan so do you think you know more about yourself than powell knows about you I, I genuinely hope so, but I'm, I'm nervous. <laughs> it's going to be fun. Are you ready to meet your super fan, Powell? Yes. All right, right. let's bring him in. Do we have Powell? We have Powell. How, how are you? How have you been? I'm doing so well, just bartending away and living the, living the dream. Living the dream. I love I'm it. I'm so I excited it. about the album. Seriously, little things. Played it more than any song I've ever played in my life. Oh Shut my up, really? I think so. It's just oh those drums God. at the beginning. You know what I'm talking about? You know what I'm talking it's about. Boom, <laughs> boom. <laughs> Lots of fun things happening. And today, Powell, you know this, but you're going to be going against Kelsey in trivia, all about Kelsey for our fan versus artist trivia. How are you feeling? Are you ready? Did you study up for this? I studied up for this, but now I'm like, questioning everything I know and I'm like, do I know anything? But we'll see. If I if I do badly, please don't, you know, hate me forever. No, <laughs> I, I often feel like I never know anything ever about what's going on. So we this. got this. We got it's it. gonna it's be gonna fun. Be so the way this game works is we have two rounds. So we're gonna start with our tablet round. And Powell, I know you're gonna be using a pen and paper, so we've got that. So the way this round works is there's five questions total. I'm gonna ask the question and you write your answer down on your phone or your paper. I'll count you down. We'll turn around. If you get the answer correct, you each get a point. Sound good? It's a pretty easy yeah. round. Yeah, I'm ready. Perfect, let's do it. Question one of our tablet round, here we go. The cover art for Kelsey's new album, Subject to Change, features her in what color dress? Oh, Kelsey's writing, Powell's writing. Oh, this is an easy one. Okay, the cover art for Kelsey's new album, Subject to Change, features her in what color dress? Kelsey, are you locked in? Powell, are you locked in? Locked in. Let's yeah. show the camera, three, two, one. Powell says yellow. Kelsey says yellow. yellow. Kelsey, your handwriting. I love it. <laughs> no, it's chaotic, but it's just oh. because you. I, I was like, wait, Z Zillow? I was like, the. Uh, the <laughs> Is that a new color? I can't. <laughs> I think I made it too. I made the I made the pin too thick, but now I don't know how to fix it. So <laughs> I love it. Okay, so that is correct. You both are right. An easy one to start off. Kelsey gets a point. Powell gets a point. Powell's feeling better. Thank God, I'm sweating. <laughs> All right, here we go. Question number two. Okay. Kelsey's music video for Peter Pan has roughly how many YouTube views? I don't even know a ballpark, to be honest. I'm just going to say one's tough. But I'm kind of, I'm kind of worried that it's going to be too high and then I'm going to look stupid. <laughs> <laughs> Shoot for the stars. Shoot for the stars. Oh my God, Emily Jinx, we just both said shoot for the stars. Oh my God. Okay, I did, um, I did a big number and I think that maybe I'm just gassing myself up. Okay. Okay, Kelsey, I love that energy. Okay, so Kelsey, are you locked in? Powell, do you have your number written? Yes. I'm locked in. Let's show the camera in three, two, one. We have Kelsey with 60 million. 60. How with 11 million. And the correct answer is 68 million. Oh, wow. So Kelsey, you are actually close, but and how I love the 11 million. Listen, that's but we still a lot. Bump that up. I, I low key actually had no idea. And so that's, I'm sorry, Kelsey, I can't give it to you. You're 8 million off, but you were close enough. So Kelsey does not get a point. Powell okay. does not get a point, but that's okay. There's still time. Question number three, what is Kelsey's debut studio album titled? All right, Powell's writing, Kelsey's writing. Are we locked in? Yeah. All right, let's show the locked camera in. in three, two, one. Kelsey said the first time, Powell said the first time. That is correct. And oh. he's doing for you both again. Okay, Woo. we're cooking now. We're killing it. All right, so Kelsey gets a point for that one. Powell gets a point for that one. And we are on to question four. What year did Kelsey first perform at the famous venue, the Grand Ole Opry? And bonus points if you can tell us the month. Okay. Oh, well, Kelsey. Oh, she, okay. Okay. Kelsey's locked in. How, I'm guessing the, how are you I feeling? Is, I, I, you know, I think the year is right. The month, I just picked one out of 12. So we'll see. <laughs> so we have okay odds. Yeah. I see I'm opposite. I, I remember the exact day. I don't know if I had the year right. Okay. 
Oh, you remember the day. Okay. All right. So let's show the camera in three, two, one. Kelsey says, February 14th, 2015. Pal says March 2015. It actually is February 14th, 2015. Pally, you're so close. <laughs> I felt it. I felt it. I felt the Valentine's Day vibes. You knew. It, it, okay. Yeah. So we're going to give Kelsey two points on that one. And then Powell gets one point. Okay, fair enough. Okay, so Kelsey, that moment is burned into your mind. You know the date? I mean, can you think of a better place to spend Valentine's Day than debuting at the Grendel Opry? Great. Could not be I better. Oh my gosh. And then, and wow. then another year, I played the Ryman for the first time on Valentine's Day. It, for some reason, things always fall on that day. So, But that's then you have your I Hate Love song. So then I feel like the nice juxtaposition there too. Yeah, <laughs> of course, of course. All right, so we have one more question in our tablet round. <laughs> Powell fanning himself. Okay, question five. How old was Kelsey when she was listed in Forbes 30 under 30 list? Okay. I didn't even know that I was. Um, <laughs> I mean, it, it must've been a long time ago. Cause I certainly didn't. Is it true, Lisa? It is? Yeah, she, yeah, it is true. Yeah, our producer just confirmed it too. Accomplishments over here. Oh man, Kelsey, well, congratulations for being in 30 under 30. No cheating. Did one of, did one of your team tell you off the camera? No, 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 <laughs> she didn't tell me that I was in it. So let's show the camera in three, two, one. We have Kelsey with 25, Powell with 24. Oh. The correct answer was actually 23. Oh. Oh, you were so close. So Listen. Kelsey, you were 23 where you're in Forbes 30 under 30. That's wow. impressive. I, wow. <laughs> wow, wow, to you. wow. That's amazing. <laughs> the fact that you didn't know that makes it even so better. <laughs> I'm crying. That's really funny. Okay. So that is the end of our tablet round. Before we move into the lightning round, let's do a quick score check. Okay. So producer Dylan's coming through. We have Kelsey with four points and Powell with three. So this is anyone's game. We got, uh, yep, 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 yep. Here we go. Powell's ready. Oh my God. I feel like an athlete. The lightning round is where it gets really fun. We're going to put 45 seconds on the clock. Okay. I'm going to ask a question, but here's the thing. You cannot raise your hand to answer the question until I'm done asking it. So there's no cheating there. Whoever raises their hand first gets to answer the question. If you get the question right, you get a point. If you get it wrong, the other person gets a chance to steal. Okay. okay. I like this. I like this. Yeah, here we go. So it's going to be go. fun. All right. Producer Dylan, 45 seconds on the clock. Question one. Kelsey performed which hit song at the 2018 Victoria's Secret Fashion Show? Oh, we got, I think we got Powell on that one. Is that correct? It was Powell. Okay, Powell, what song is it? This Feeling? It was This Feeling. Let's go. Oh, we're even now. No. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, coming, I'm coming for you. But that was a close one. That was close. Okay, hands down. Here we go. Question number two. True or false? Kelsey is a double Virgo cancer moon. We've got Kelsey. True, I just learned this about myself. You just learned it? And apparently it really checks out. Really? <laughs> <That's accurate. laughs> For people that know more about astrology than I do, apparently they're like, that is correct. Like, this like, makes <laughs> sense. <laughs> Can't wait to oh, And that is that. correct. That is true. Kelsey gets a point on that one. Okay, congrats, congrats. <laughs> <laughs> Powell's a good sport. <laughs> Question three. In 2021, Kelsey temporarily filled in for which coach on The Voice? We got Powell. We got Powell. The icon Kelly Clarkson. The icon, icon Kelly Clarkson. Oh, who's coming up? Who's on the new song? Who's on the new song? I am so, I, like, I, how, honestly, how dare you even, like, it's the most perfect thing I've ever heard of. Yeah, wait till you hear it. Oh my God, I'm so excited. It's, and probably it's, it's probably my favorite so on the album, truly. It's so good. That's what you were saying, that it was your favorite. Yes. Okay, so we've got two more. Here we go. True or false? Kelsey won Best New Country Artist at the 2017 iHeartRadio Music Awards. Powell. Um, true. It is true. Woo! Oh, you're oh making my... me nervous there. That oh, hesitation. Sorry to show you my sweaty arms. Kelsey I... doesn't remember any of her awards. No, <laughs> so I, black out. I black out. It's because I get so nervous. I get so nervous. I knew that I won that. I just didn't know what year, and I didn't want to sound stupid, so I didn't do it. I didn't raise you're my in 30 under 30, the awards. I mean, you're, I had a good 20s. <laughs> what a thrill. She's not even done with the 20s yet. What's going to happen? Really year? One more year. Yeah. <laughs> okay, our last question. Here we go. Finish the lyric. I got a Jeep. I got a dog. I got what they call a dream job. It's Kelsey. Then you don't want nothing wrong with that, but I'm happy with what I have. 
<laughs> oh, good. Oh, okay, that, that, See, I'm not that, even mad about that one. I'm yeah, we, we gotta give it up. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God, Kelsey, beautiful. Okay, Kelsey obviously gets a point on that one. And that is the end of our lightning round. Are we tied? Okay, ooh, we did it. The final yeah. score, we have Kelsey with six. Howell with six. So we are going Whoa. into our tiebreaker question. Go. This is for all the marbles. All right. Ooh. All right. Give me the marbles. I'm sweating. I'm honestly give sweating. Me give yeah, me the marbles. Give me the marbles. It's contagious. Here we go. The last question. Kelsey posted a TikTok the other day celebrating her birthday at another artist concert. Whose concert was it? We've got Kelsey. <laughs> Harry Styles. Yes. Harry. Oh. Which, by the way, Kelsey, how was that? Oh my gosh, it was so much fun. I It was like the perfect way to kick off a birthday. I just danced like an embarrassing amount. Kelsey, you did get a point, which Powell, that means this was such a close run. Listen, it's a, it's a, it was a valiant effort on both parts. It and was, it was. I'm glad that like Kelsey, I feel like should have, like I should have, she knows herself better than I. <laughs> well, that's what I was gonna say. I'm like, if you if you know me better than I know me, then like I, I need to do some, <laughs> We need some more astrology readings then on that. <laughs> yeah, but, exactly. I do appreciate how close this game was. And Powell, before we actually have to wrap, while you're here with Kelsey, you're her biggest fan. Is there anything that you want to say to Kelsey? Listen, I'm just so excited for you and this new album, this new chapter in so many ways. And thank you for keeping the music coming. It, I feel like it just gets better every time. So I could not be more excited for the album. And I'm so excited to see you on tour. It's going to be which, so fun. Which I'm show? So which show? Uh, Atlanta, Atlanta. Oh, uh, I'm so excited. It's, and I, it's a brand I, new venue too. It's an awesome venue. It's so cool. I'm so excited. So excited. And for you, Casey, how does it feel have, having fans like Powell? I am so excited about this tour, mainly just because I just want to like be around everyone. Like I just want to hang out. You know what I mean? It's just, it's been so freaking long and I love this record so much. And I just know that like, it's going to like, like d like deepen our like connection and that makes me so happy so i can't wait hey my name is powell and unfortunately i did just lose fan verse artist trivia against my favorite singer kelsey ballerini uh, i'm not embarrassed but i'm gonna persevere i think that, i think it'll be okay i have been a fan of kelsey since i think like 2016 which felt late to the game but once i got on the fandom train it's been full speed ahead ever since so it's she's a great person to be a fan of but i love her music I think I'm Kelsey's biggest fan, mainly because she makes me feel like a fierce, long blonde hair country singer, which is what I've been, wanted to be since before I can remember. So I think I just kind of emanate everything that makes a biggest fan. Puts me at the top of the list. If I had to share one thing with Kelsey, I think it would just be a lot of gratitude for the music over the years. Um, we're close in age, so I feel like we're kind of growing up in similar ways, so it's kind of been the soundtrack to my life. Thank you so, so much, iHeartRadio and Kelsey, of course, for letting me play fan vs. artist trivia. I honestly impressed myself. It was a close game. So thank you so much, iHeartRadio, iHeartKelsey, and I heart myself, which is important. Thanks so much for checking out our fan versus artist trivia with Kelsey Ballerini. Make sure you stream her new album, Subject to Change. It's out now on iHeartCountry, and we'll see you next time.